Who are you? Have you ever had your navigation tell you to go the wrong way? And even worse, ask you to turn left across four lanes of freeway traffic? Do you listen to your device? Of course not. Because you know the navigation is wrong and you don't identify with the technology as always being right. Beliefs are also like a navigator and can steer you in the wrong direction. If you can turn off the navigation and not identify with your beliefs, you could potentially steer yourself towards something better, or at least avoid disaster. When you have a belief spectrum that is based on separation, disempowerment, either of yourself or others, and idolization, you can lose yourself in a belief system of dogma. Dogma will separate you and limit your identity because of its nature. You can free your mind when you let go of dogma. And this is where you need to be careful because every rabbit hole does not lead to wonderland. When you release your belief system, your ego will tell you to replace your beliefs because the hole needs to be filled. You can fill the hole with inclusive, non-judgmental, and non-separative kindness or the alternative, which could lead you down a worse path. You can begin to see if you are a victim of a dogmatic perception of the world by questioning your beliefs. You can recreate your identity by recreating your beliefs. A freedom-based identity is within your belief system. If you take full responsibility for your life, then you're free to live your life with a new identity that is not chained by an old identity. Still, you should take responsibility and not blame your surroundings because true freedom comes from having the power to respond to the world the way you want.